Hello, my dear students. This video uh, I made only for the ICSC students for class 10. Actually, as you know, yesterday the ICSC has announced that the class 10 students may give the exams or may not give means there are two options the council has given the two options to the students the first one to give the exams offline along with the class 12 students and the second option not to give the offline but there is a point not to give the offline means the board will decide the something uh, to give the marks. But what the council will decide? That nobody knows now. Just I can guess. Anyone can guess. So there are mainly because uh, I'm in uh, the same uh, profession. So I can guess the how many points can be there to award the marks the first one uh, the internal assessments of the class 10 means the board can uh, take the internal assessment marks for the uh, of the class 10 that has already gone to the uh, means submitted to the uh, board the second point the marks of the pre-board exams of the schools because you have given already the one pre-board or two pre-board exams every school has taken the exams okay maybe online or maybe offline so the council can ask the pre-board exams marks of the pre-board exams the third one and very important because the, these two the internal assessment and the uh, pre-board exams are of online and the uh, marks you cannot say that the very uh, uh, perfect are uh, the very uh, that is the what the sahi tarikhe se judge kiye gaye ho aisa nahi keh sakte but the one thing is there the last point marks of your class 9th annual examination because class 9th annual paper uh, came from the council if you remember that came from the council to every school every ICSC school so that is why the council can ask means uh, this is not um, uh, this is not a very uh, sure I am not very sure but council may ask for the marks of the class 9 exams annual exams especially so these three criteria may be and also the some more criteria uh, that uh, the council can uh, uh, choose or any other thing that uh, depends on the council but why I have made this video because uh, there are the confusion my dear students there are many students that are in confusion that whether they have to give means exams or means uh, they do means uh, not give the exams in that case some uh, thoughts i have some thoughts and these thoughts are like this as you know that uh, all of you know yourself very apne aap ke bare mein sab log jante hain means up to what extent you can uh, get the marks in the offline exams so if you choose the option just you think about yourself means can you get the more than that marks which you are what you have uh, scored uh, till now for in class 9 and class 10 means in the 
board examination can you get the more than that okay first you think yourself otherwise some points i uh, some points are in my mind in my mind and that i want to share with you uh, these uh, type uh, these points that you can think about this so the first one i if i talk about the percentages like uh, the students there are various uh, types of students various types of means the scoring 40% 50% 60% 70% 80% 90% more than 90% that is 100% also the uh, some students so i have here categories that is the first one if the students icsc student means from class 9 until if they score throughout that 40% to 60% marks in the examination various examinations are there then it is my view that is you of the second uh, option that you choose the second option that is not to give the exam why because you will get more than that if the board will ask the internal assessment or pre board marks or any other thing then the board will uh, absolutely will give the more than that of uh, 60% marks to you so it is my view that uh, please go to the second option means take the second option means not to give the exam second thing those are getting the scoring the 60% to 80% marks from in class 9 as well as in class 10 then they have the chance to improve their marks in the offline examination means they have to give the exams because they are actually studying those are getting the 60% to 80% it means they are studying and they have the knowledge and in between these times during these time also they are uh, studying so in that case you will get more than that 80% marks more than that those are getting the 80% more than that they will get those are getting the 60 or 70% more than that also you will get so i suggest you choose first option the last one is the very confusing that is the those are scoring more than 85% or you can say the more than 90% marks in the examination of means in class 9 and class 10 examination in the pre board in annual examination in unit test in every day because they are the they are or actually scoring the marks 85% more than 85 means 90% 92% 95% so they have the two uh, options if you choose if you choose that they are not uh, uh, to not to give the exam it means if you are not giving the exam then actually you will get the more than 90% marks more than 90% without any uh, confusion but if you are choosing the option to give the exam offline in that case you have the confusion means you will be in doubt till the result you will be in doubt till the result that you is uh, get the means uh, 90 above the 90% or 92% or 95% till the result jab tak result nahi aata tab tak ye rahega doubt mein rahega ki kitna aayega ya tension mein you will be in tension you can say to sabse pehle and if you are not bother about the percentage above 90% suppose anyone is getting the 90% और किसी के आफ्टर गिविंग द एग्जाम ऑफलाइन एग्जाम 92% आ गया या कोई के 92% है एंड आफ्टर गिविंग द एग्जाम गेटिंग द 94% एंड तो ये 1% 2% डजंट मैटर इफ यू आर नॉट बॉदर अबाउट द परसेंटेज बिकॉज़ इन दिस 4 मंथ्स इफ यू काउंट फ्रॉम टुडे देन फ्रॉम द देयर आर द आई थिंक द हाफ मंथ ऑफ द अप्रैल मे जून जुलाई 
three and a half months, and the uh, uh, August mid August the result will come. I think the up to mid August you can say. So four months do hai ye you will be in tension. Ki kaise result aayega? Kya marks aayenge? Means you cannot prepare the you cannot do the preparation for the other competitive exam that you will you are um, going to give in the future. Means like the JEE, like NEET, other exams. So better if you are not uh, uh, means you are not doing the exams. So that will be better for you. क्योंकि इससे हम तुम्हारे पास में you can save your four months and if you save your four months then you can prepare yourself for the other competitions you can start your study otherwise ये tenth की ही study करते रहेंगे तो this is my view that if you are scoring throughout more than 85% more than 90% then in my view that go to the second option means uh, leave this uh, go, uh, means not to give the offline exam and leave on the board and board will give obviously if you, he will, uh, the counselor will give you the more than uh, that marks those you are scoring in the annual exam and pre board exams तो ये एक छोटा सा हमारा वीडियो था जिसको अगर पूरी तरह से सब लोग देखते हैं तो और समझेंगे इसको ठीक से तो समझ में आएगा कि क्या चीज तुम्हारे लिए व्हाट विल बी बेटर फॉर यू मींस यू हैव टू गिव और नॉट टू ये देना है कि नहीं देने देना टू गिव और नॉट टू तो इस तरह से हम बोल सकते हैं कि किसी भी स्टूडेंट्स को कंफ्यूजन नहीं होनी चाहिए फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू हैव टू थिंक योर सेल्फ एंड देन चूज द ऑप्शन बिफोर दैट यू हैव टू थिंक मीन्स कैन यू डू ये हमारा क्वेश्चन है तुमसे कि कैन यू डू इन दिनेशन ऑफ लाइफ बिकॉज सम आर देयर दैट Getting less than forty percent also, तो उनके लिए तो बहुत अच्छा चांस है कि they also means leave the exams and then go to the that option, the second option, not to give the exam. Or they will get obviously they will get the uh, marks more than fifty percent, sixty percent. तो उनके लिए काफी बेहतर होगा. Okay, so thank you and uh, keep this in uh, in your mind. and uh, sub uh, this one follow my channel study bright you will get the sufficient knowledge about your study and especially the mathematics thank you